welcome back to my channel. Today I have a Kmart haul for you guys, one of our favourites on this channel and I have a bunch of things to show you. So I'm just going to jump straight in. If this kind of video is your vibe, please subscribe to my channel. We would love to have you as a part of our family and let's get right into it. First is one of these large visual diaries or visual art diaries. So this is the A3 size. If you guys have been around for a while, you would know that I love using these as notebooks. I have one right here for all the videos I'm going to film today. But this one I am going to use for what I bought this one for, <laughs> which was to print out a whole lot of photos for each room in our house. That is, it's basically going to be like a vision board with different pages for different spaces in our house um, for what I want to do. So I've got a whole lot of photos printed out already for some of the spaces. Um, and yeah, this is gonna be like our house planning renovations book. <laughs> because I printed so many photos out and then I realized that this was gonna be just too small. Like it's not, it wasn't gonna be big enough because I have too many ideas and I want to have space to write things as well. So that, the plan for this one. That was a very long winded explanation for our first item. We are on track for how these videos normally go. <laughs> so next thing is this weighted hula hoop. Um, I saw this, I am, now that we are engaged, I am on a bit of a mission to not necessarily lose weight, but I just want to tone up, tone my body basically and get back into some kind of fitness routine because I'm doing nothing. So, but this really intrigued me and I was like, oh, you could do that while you're watching TV. So I'm gonna try this out and see how I like it. If I use it, I don't know, we'll see. <laughs> Evan and I bought this together a really long time ago. Um, it is a neck light LED flexible, on point naming as always. So it, it hoops around your neck and is a torch. <laughs> So the sun is starting to be very annoying there. Hopefully that's not messing with everything. Um, but you can have one or the other on or both and it's battery powered. Yeah, flexible, hands-free and lightweight apparently. Um, we grabbed this, it's in the camping section um, because I like to read and Evan has to sleep a lot earlier than I do. So this is what it looks like. Um, the battery goes in here. So I don't know if there actually is a battery or not in there. Is there? No, there's not. But anyway, it goes around your neck. You can angle them however you want. So that's pretty cool. I'm going to put this beside my bed so that I can get back into reading at night time because I've gotten very much so out of that habit in the last few years and I want to get back into it but I also don't want to keep Evan awake when he gets up so early for work in the morning so enter this thing hopefully it's good if not it'll just be something we take camping and I'll just wear it around my neck when it's dark I don't know. <laughs> alrighty I have two big bags here to go through I'm gonna start with this one because it's very boring and you guys know what I'm gonna say about this <laughs> So these are just the Soda Stream, um, what are they? Like low calorie options. So one's lemonade, one's orange and mango. They're nice and they have less calories than the others. So we get these. I have two of each. So Soda Stream. <laughs> that is really starting to blind me. I guarantee it's going to be messing up my lighting, isn't it? Sorry. I found one of these. This was on clearance and I don't know why because there is literally nothing wrong with it um, and they still sell them. So I, it might have been a mistake. I'm not sure. This is the large ribbed glass canister. This is going to be, ooh, it's got plastic in. Um, this is going to be for cat treats. Um, I am not sure if my Target haul video has gone up before this or not, but I did also get a very similar one from Target that looks like this. This one's got her little treaty treats in it. These are like toothbrush treats. And this one is going to have these sachets in it because these are slightly too tall for that one. Um, so yeah, this will have these inside. So yeah, these are just those like, 
They're not wet food, they're like more liquid than wet food, but they're not liquid. <laughs> I don't know. You can tell that Annie was a real old cat because she didn't get things like this. Um, she didn't touch them. Um, and Raven is a kitten. Um, so she's getting all the treats and stuff and Annie just had no interest in them. But I am putting them in things like these because we did have treats for Annie. For one, she wasn't interested in them. And for two, they were in a cupboard, in a container, in boxes. So I literally always forgot that they existed. Um, and so we never got to give them to her, but she didn't like them anyway. So these are going to be out on the bench with her food, um, which is also in a Kmart jar thing. I'll put the photo of the one that it's in up there. And we also have a bigger version of that, this thing, um, for the dog treats, like the dog dried liver. So we've got all kinds of glass jars with bamboo lids going on for the pet food. So that's the vibe we're going with at the moment, apparently, I don't know. <laughs> I also have a pack of four forks. Um, Evan loves to deny that he does this, but he takes them to work and then they just disappear into the abyss. So I just got some plain forks. I wanted to get the same um, that we have in our kitchen, well, already, but you have to buy the whole set and it's, we don't need any other thing. We only need forks. So I just got these. It's gonna drive me insane that they're not matching, but these are gonna be the ones that Evan is allowed to take to work because they're different and they're not my good ones. So that's what these are. They're the Madison forks if you're interested. Alrighty, second bag. What a jug. Um, this is my second one of these. I've got one already at the moment that I use for banana water. If you don't know what that is, I have filmed a reel about it. I've just never edited it and put it up. So I might put that up um, when this video is about to go live, but it's basically water that has banana peels in it that's really good for your plants. But I don't want to reuse the one that has banana water in it, actual water. So this one's going to be for actual water. Um, and yeah, I really like these. We did have, if you've been on the channel for a while, you might have seen a haul where I had the black glass ribbed water jugs from Kmart. Um, they are good. I broke one. <laughs> um, I was putting it back in the shelf. So this is the shelf and I like slightly tapped it ever so slightly on the corner of the jug and it just shattered like the bottom just fell out and water went everywhere so now we've only got one of those left um, and I haven't seen them for ages so I didn't buy another one of those but these are also about twice the size so you can fit way more water in these they are just called the glass fridge jug um, and they're just cute and pretty so I feel like eventually because these ones are they, I, they're just better um, the lid you would think would be crapper that's not a word, but anyway, you'd think it would be worse than the other ones because this is plastic. Um, but the lid on the other one would constantly fall apart. So it, this is just one piece, whereas the other lid is two pieces and it constantly falls apart. Um, but yeah, these are just better <laughs> in my opinion. And, ooh, and I would like to get a whole collection of them so we can have like water, milk, oat milk, and like orange juice or something in them because that would just look adorable in the fridge. But our fridge is really ugly, so. Don't need to do that until we have a new fridge. So that's a while away. <laughs> Next is a little cat collar. So I grabbed this because the collar that we ordered for Raven was taking forever to arrive. And then ironically, the day that I got this, the collar arrived. So I'm gonna return this. It was only $3, but we don't need it now. Um, so I literally just used change to buy this and it's adorable. It's got a little like bow tie situation going and yeah, cute cat collar, but we don't need it anymore. So I'm gonna take it back. Um, and yeah, it's adorable. And he used to wear little bow ties as well all the time. So I thought that was really cute. Um, but now she's got one of those, all of our animals have got collars that have got our phone number on them. So they don't have to wear tags because the tags can get caught on stuff. It's a whole thing. Anyway, we don't need this. It was $3. It's very cute. If you have a cat, I recommend. The next thing in this bag is a whole bunch of these picture hook things. Um, so I've got the three pack, which has got slightly bigger ones. And then the four pack, which has slightly smaller ones. I had a whole lot of these. I used them on this wall. I'll put a picture up because you can't see all the photos. Um, but this 
I'm going to use in my filming room, which I am doing up, and I want to do a gallery wall in there as well. So I'm going to put a whole lot of different things in there. So I've got a mirror, um, artwork, pictures, all sorts of stuff that I want to hang on that wall. So I got a whole lot more of these, just so I have them in case I need to hang things. Um, so I did get more of these. I'm assuming they're at the bottom of the bag, but yeah, picture hooks. <laughs> yep, here they are. <laughs> so we have this many. Okay, last thing from the bag, not last thing for the video, but last thing from the bag is I got three of these display folders. Now that we again have Raven, I'm going to put Frost and Kai's in a new folder because their old folders are both different colors and it kind of drove me insane anyway. And these were like a dollar or something. Um, but I'm going to print a photo of each animal, put it in the front sleeve and then keep all of their vet things in here. Um, so I do have, like we had one for Annie, um, we've got one for Frost, we've got one for Kai, but they're all over the place. They're different colors, they're crap and <laughs> not. Not ideal. Anyway, um, so these have got the picture sleeve at the front, so it's just going to make them a bit more aesthetic for one, which is not the important thing, um, but like more functional because I will easily be able to be like, Frost, hi, Raven. You get the drift. Anyway, I am the psychopath animal parent who keeps, like, gets itemized receipts from the vet every single time and keeps them. So, some of you may have been around long enough to know that every now and then I buy new things to put Evan's lunch in. Um, we are still on the hunt for the perfect container. This one comes pretty damn close. Um, so these are the lunch box with trays. I have, I bought two. This is the second one. We've got another one that we've been using, but they have pretty great handles to be perfectly honest. And then it's got this thing on the top which comes out that you can put different thingies in and then a huge section at the bottom and you can still use it without the tray insert if you wanted to put something taller in there you absolutely can but these are really good um this is probably the closest thing that i have found to liking for his lunch but i do give him a lot of fruit and things so obviously it's not like you can't put an apple in there once i cut it up but he's not a small child so um that is that but it's really handy for like sandwiches and then like little snack things on top. So this one is really good. Highly recommend. Again, lunchbox with tray. Yeah. This. All right. This is a roller storage basket with handle large. <laughs> that does not roll off the tongue. Um, this I'm going to use in our fridge. Um, so we currently, is this removable? Yeah, so you can change this to wherever you want. Um, but currently our dog food is just in a, um, like one of the clear organizers from Kmart, just at the bottom of the fridge. Um, and sometimes, cause they have like meat patty things that they eat, sometimes it sticks. So I'm gonna put it in these. I, I'm aware that these are holes, so it the smell will still come out, but some days I'm just super sensitive to the smell of meat. No, I am not pregnant. Um, but some days it just really bothers me. And then other days I can't smell it at all. It doesn't matter. But I thought it would be nicer to have it in a container because the one that it's currently in, it doesn't really fit in any way. So this should be better. Okay. One more kitchen thing. Oh, this is Raven. <laughs> she did this. Anyway, it was not, there was no hole in it when I bought it. So this is the microwave shelf thing. Um, so we, uh, the way that our kitchen is laid out is really annoying and we have to have a lot of stuff on the bench because the cupboards, you can't adjust the shelves and you can't fit things in them. So that's the bane of my existence. But I, we have the microwave and then there's a whole lot of dead space on top of the microwave. So I want to use this because I currently, like I have things on top of it, but I don't really like sitting things on top of the microwave. I don't know, does that irk anyone else? It just doesn't seem, anyway. So enter microwave shelf. This I am pretty excited to open up. I have had it for a long, 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 long time. Um, so yeah, 
There's also mud on this too. That is not poop. It is mud. <laughs> we're landscaping, there's mud everywhere. It's a it's not a vibe, but it's what we're dealing with. Um so yeah. This is going to come in handy. We also do have a new microwave too. Um, we had an amazing microwave that Evan's mum bought for us a while ago, like ages ago, and it was a was it LG. I don't know, but it was awesome, but it just randomly died one day and stopped heating things. So we just replaced it with a Kmart one, this one. So that's another Kmart item for you. Um, and yeah, I, I don't know why I brought that up, but anyway, that's another thing we bought from Kmart. So is this, this top is from Kmart too. Me and my best friend got the same one at the same time, but it's really comfy. Um, I love the length of the sleeves, the folded cuff and everything. It's just cute. I don't know what it's called. Don't remember how much it was, but this is also from Kmart. Now I'm just telling you things that I got from Kmart that I don't have with me. Also, there is one more that was intentionally supposed to be a part of this video. It's just too heavy for me to carry. Um, we got the, I think it's called the Hamptons cabinet. Um, that is going to be in my filming room. I am hoping to film it, film it. I'm hoping to put it together today. I don't think I'll have time, but I am hoping and um, that's going to be my storage in my filming room because at the moment I don't really have anything. We have the cupboard, but we've taken the door off it and it's, it's a whole thing. Um, and the room was just getting full of junk. So the reason for all of the hauls you're getting lately is because I have pulled everything out that I've been hoarding for the past five months and not filmed because of just mental health stuff. Um, and we are getting that room put together. It is gonna happen and I'm excited about it. Um, so that shelf is something else that I've got from Kmart. That's one of the online only things. Um, so that, that that's that. <laughs> okay, last but not least is a very popular one that you have probably seen all over Instagram and TikTok and such, but this is the Scalloped Circular Mirror. So this is 55 centimeters in diameter. Um, it's just cute, it's interesting. I'm going to put this, well the idea is that this is going to be on my gallery wall in the filming room. Um, so it's just gorgeous. When I first saw it, I wasn't really super keen, but the more I saw it online and then the more I saw it in store out of the box, I was like, it's cute. <laughs> so it's cute, everyone has it, but that's fine. Um, so that that is the next thing that I, that I had to show you. There's not really much to say about it. It's a mirror, it's, circular and that's it and that's also it for the video too because that's all my stuff that I've got to show you my hair is starting to fall out sun is starting to annoy me it's becoming a whole thing I'm sweating I'm glad I'm done <laughs> um so thank you so much if you made it this far thanks for joining me I hope you enjoyed let me know down below what you are the most excited to see put in my house somewhere um i have more hauls coming i have i think one or two more came up ones to film because i have a huge pile out there um but i need to do something about this lighting situation before i continue filming so that's gonna be it for this one thank you for joining me um subscribe if you would like to be a part of the family and i will see you in the next video bye guys